Hey, hey, OpenAI ChatGPT for all model is here. And today we are exploring seven incredible use cases of this model in daily life. And the first use case is AI companion. Can act like a human, providing responses that are more human-like and understanding emotions through the voice which is crazy, isn't it? Before it was more like chat with a robotics voice. So let's dive in in six more use cases. But first of all, of course, subscribe for this channel for more insights about AI and business and career from founder living in Silicon Valley. And don't forget to like this video to appreciate all my efforts. The next is simulated conversations. You can set up multiple personas to interact with each other which can be useful for debate, preparation, or role-playing scenarios. For example, my first thought about that is, oh, let's play a game of uh, preparing for the uh, sales script, right? One chat GPT for all model will be representing the buyer who actually don't want to buy this solution. Or another scenario is the buyer who want to purchase this solution. And another, GPT for all will be representing the human who would like to sell this solution and overcoming all objections which the person might have. And I think this is super cool and this is what I will try to do with my startup. But you know, this also can help you to manage any conflict and um, many debates. So that's powerful, isn't it? And this is the example how it works. Many people told that this is a powerful, uh, cool feature which helped them to prepare for the presentation. For example, once you're preparing for a presentation to an investor, it was in my case many times, there could be thousands of different questions about your business and you have to be able to answer it right away. And it seems like you know already everything, but at the same time, you have to know how to answer that and it's better to practice. With this model, you can practice. The next one is one of the coolest use case for GPT-40. It's advanced medical diagnostics. So GPT-40 assists doctors in diagnosing diseases, suggesting treatments and providing up-to-date medical information. You know, I've been to this Google conference in Sunnyvale here in California, and I remember when the person on the stage from the Bill Gates Foundation explained about amazing use cases right now they are seeing in Asia, in the poorest countries of the world, where people actually are using chatbots, like the previous capabilities of ChatGPT 3.5, the simplest one, um, where they are asking some questions about like which pain they have. Um, and also there is, was a picture of doctors who has a printed version of answers of GPT to help them to come up with a solution, what they should do with this type of disease or which treatment is better for the person. Because the thing is that not everywhere in the world, doctors have the same education, right? It pretend to be similar, but it's very different. Different. And also accessible education is another cool thing which I believe in so much and I feel so much power with this uh, AI and I think that the world would be better in the future. It depends through which lens you see this world but it's another topic and this is just about the mindset. But in general, can you imagine that um, doctors right now all over the planet will be able to have the same information? Like, let's talk about not some very complex diseases, but something what is pretty understandable in well-developed countries, but completely new or completely unknown or uh, using outdated ways of treatment in uh, countries which are developing, right? So this is very cool. And the next use case is data analysis and visualization. GPT-40 can analyze complex data sets generate insights and create detailed visualization. For example, one user told that I uploaded my data set and GPT-40 quickly analyzed and visualized the information, making it easily to understand with the complex trends. I already mentioned that I truly believe in accessible education in the world. Do you remember that time when you were a kid? and you don't understand something and then you got back from school and you have to complete your 
homework. Right now, I think that the education is much better. And right now, with this use case, the kids or adults can actually talk to GPT-40 and ask any questions gpt 40 will explain anything needs to be explained you know that the person will understand the topic this is the best use case ever help the human to understand and the next one is customer support automation really with chat 40 it's possible to have very great and very high quality customer support not only by text but also by voice or even by call you can have zero humans or one two people for handling the very complex troubleshootings or situations and for the rest the AI will help that's it and of course it's cheaper I, I know I know you will tell me okay but so many people will lose jobs but AI also will create lots of new opportunities so please think from another side and the last but not least least of course it's content creation and it's just getting better and better with capabilities of gpt 40 you can generate engaging and targeted content for social media blogs and advertising campaigns very personalized very precise targeting for your auditory also helps to come up with a new ideas and to go beyond limitations of your creativity which is very cool and i think that this is incredible seven use cases which i found very useful my favorite too is about doctors and about education but tell me please what was your favorite use case or maybe you come up with some other idea how to use gpt 40 and about the best three ai tools for your work and for your your business watch the next video